Cases of H3N2 influenza virus have seen a sudden spike in the country with two deaths being reported in Haryana and Karnataka due to the virus. However, the infection while contagious is quite similar to the common cold and viral fever. Here is more. The number of cases of the influenza A virus in parts of India are skyrocketing, especially in Gurugram, Noida, Delhi and other NCR regions. The ICMR has described seasonal influenza as an acute respiratory infection caused by influenza viruses which circulate in all parts of the world and the cases increased during certain months globally. Droplets emitted when a person with the highly contagious H3N2 influenza coughs, sneezes or speaks can spread the illness from one person to another. In addition, the virus can be spread if a person touches their mouth or nose after coming in contact with the surface that has the infection. Complications from the flu are more likely to occur in pregnant women, young children, elderly adults and people with underlying medical conditions. H3N2 influenza virus can show symptoms similar to COVID-19. The list of early signs include chills, coughing, fever, nausea, vomiting, throat ache, sore throat, an ache in muscles and body, in some cases diarrhea, sneezing and runny nose. These symptoms usually may last for about a week. However, some people may endure them for a longer period of time too. Kids with asthma, obesity, heart diseases, diabetes and weakened immune systems are at increased risk of getting infected. The infection usually lasts for about 5 to 7 days. The fever might go away at the end of 3 days. Cough might persist longer even in case of mild infection. If the cough is increasing and fever continues to rise even after 3 days, it is best to get in touch with a doctor again. Bureau Report, Goa 365